Water is essential for life. It's the elixir that keeps our bodies running smoothly, helping us regulate temperature, flush out waste, and perform vital bodily functions. But did you know that drinking too much water, too quickly, can actually be dangerous? In this video, we'll explore the risks of overhydration, what causes it, its symptoms, and who is most at risk. First, let's understand what causes overhydration. It can happen in two main ways, by drinking excessive amounts of water or if your kidneys retain too much water. When overhydration occurs, the body's water volume becomes too large for the kidneys to manage, leading to water toxicity. This dilutes the electrolytes in your body, causing cells to swell. Water intoxication can have severe consequences. Rapidly dropping blood sodium levels can result in a condition called hyponatremia, leading to neurological changes such as hallucinations and confusion. Water intoxication is a life-threatening condition. If left untreated, it can cause permanent brain damage and even death. Recognizing the symptoms of overhydration is crucial. Symptoms of overhydration may not be obvious initially, but urine color can indicate your hydration level. Pale yellow urine is ideal, resembling lemonade. Darker urine signals a need for more water, while colorless urine suggests overhydration. If you develop hyponatremia from water toxicity, symptoms may include nausea, vomiting, headaches, confusion, drowsiness, and muscle cramps. Severe cases can lead to brain cell swelling, causing seizures, coma, and potentially death. Who's at risk? Individuals with conditions like diabetes, congestive heart failure, or kidney disease are vulnerable. Most severe cases of water intoxication stem from intense physical activities like military training or marathons. Water intoxication is also associated with MDMA, ecstasy, use, particularly at music festivals. Dancing in hot environments for extended periods, combined with MDMA's effects on body temperature, can lead to excessive water consumption. However, MDMA also causes urine retention, allowing fluid buildup in the body, posing a risk of overhydration. So, how much water is too much? There's no fixed amount that guarantees safety from water poisoning. Instead, consider how much water you consume per hour, factoring in age, gender, and health. While a healthy adult's kidneys can handle 20 to 28 liters of water daily, they can only process about 1 liter per hour. Drinking more than this can overwhelm the kidneys. Aim for 9 to 13 cups of fluids daily to avoid overhydration. If you have medical conditions like diabetes or heart failure, consult your doctor for personalized advice. Older adults and children may need to limit their intake further due to less efficient kidneys. If you feel excessively thirsty, seek medical attention, as it could indicate an underlying health issue. Remember, while water is vital for life, too much of a good thing can be harmful. Stay hydrated, but always listen to your body and drink responsibly. Thanks for watching.